On the east side of Portland, people dealt with quite a bit of snow, up to four inches, and it stuck around pretty much all day. This is a look from a drone shot by Fox 12 photographer Mike Heinrich. Stunning images there. Well, now Fox 12 Simon Gutierrez is live at Northeast Gillum and Davis, where there's been a road closure since early this morning. Simon, what's it like out there this evening? Well, Nora, good and cold for one thing, uh, a biting east wind, and we're already seeing some refreezing out here, and that could make that road behind us here a real nightmare to drive on. Okay, here we go. It was not so nightmarish this morning as families took advantage of the closure, turning the road into a sledding hill east of I-205 on southeast Stark. Meanwhile, a biting east wind kept temperatures around freezing for most of the day. Peabot plow trucks cleared away packed snow into the early afternoon. And up near the summit of Mount Tabor, neighbors ventured out carefully in spite of ice and slush still on the road. So what do you do when you're driving in this stuff? I'm very cautious. Slow down. I drive a Subaru. It gets me around. Now, neighbors tell us that overall they felt like the city of Portland did a much better job this time around with this particular storm than they did a couple of years ago with that major snowstorm that left people stranded on highways for hours in some situations. That said, they realize there's more to come this week and they're waiting to see how that happens. Reporting live in southeast Portland, pardon me, northeast Portland, Simon Gutierrez, Fox 12, Oregon.